and I'm going to read The Very Hungry Caterpillar. It's by Eric Carle, so he did all of the words and pictures. When it just says them alone and it doesn't have anybody else with them, that means they were the author, they wrote the words, and the illustrator. They created the pictures that were missing. I think y'all are going to really like this book. It's got really good art in it. It just looks so pretty. We've been talking a lot about eating healthy things, and that's what this book is about. The Very Hungry Caterpillar. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. Here's the little egg. And look, the moon looks like it has a little face in it. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop, out of the egg came a tiny, very hungry caterpillar. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. He comes out of the apple now. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. Two, three plums. There he comes out of the plums. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries, but he was still hungry. One, two, three, four strawberries. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, but he was still hungry. Oh my goodness. It is Friday. It's the end of the week and he's still a hungry caterpillar. Oh my goodness, friends. You cannot believe what happens on Saturday. Look at this. Look at all the different things. Let's see. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and one slice of watermelon. That night, he had a stomachache. Look at his little face. Ooh, he doesn't look like he feels really good, does he? Are any of those foods healthy foods? not not really you had some fruit early on but fruit has a lot of sugars in it oh my goodness. the next day was Sunday again the caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf and after that he felt much better so what did he eat that made him feel better a nice green leaf that's kind of like when we eat salads and we get some more of those nutrients and vitamins in us that helps us to feel better. Oh, oh my goodness. He's not such a tiny caterpillar anymore, is he? Now he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big, fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out, and... What do you think is going to happen? He put himself into a cocoon. What do you think is going to happen? I think you might be right. Let's see. <gasps> he was a beautiful butterfly. Look at that. He wasn't a caterpillar anymore. He changed. That's the end, friends. I hope you enjoyed that book. That was a really good one. Bye, friends.